today I'm gonna show you how I made this glitter epoxy license plate frame. <laughs> This is gonna be quick and easy like your wedding night. <laughs> okay, I'm just kidding. I have been wanting to do something cute with my license plates for a hot minute, but I just hadn't gotten a customized license plate. But the other day I was browsing through my favorite place, Amazon, and I found this incredible license plate silicone mold. And I thought to myself, are you kidding me? To make myself a pink glitter mold thank you so what i did was i bought these containers from amazon because they hold a little bit more epoxy than the typical 100 milliliter cups so this is for like resin art and stuff like that now what i like to do is i like to lay my measuring cup completely flat on the table like my booty <laughs> and then i like to sit eye level and do equal parts i always start with part a because it is a thicker heavier consistency and then i go in with my part b this is also how i mix my epoxy for my tumblers it's my favorite way and uh yeah it's my favorite so check it out if you want to um then i also bought these like stirring sticks from amazon i think they're really supposed to be for margaritas which honestly which be it would be a much more funner use but i use them because they've got a long stick <laughs> and so they fit in these larger mixing containers so i am going in with sugar sweet and diva you know and just making a cute little glittery mix i normally go for like the super bright bright neon pinks but for this i kind of wanted like a really pretty bubblegum barbie just super beautiful pink but not like necessarily neon so when I do molds I always start with 99% alcohol and I spray it inside of my mold because guess what check this out this is cool when you put your epoxy inside of your mold a lot of the bubbles pop on contact you're welcome okay I know that's not a really cool trick but I just felt so cool acting like I was really like teaching you you know so just let me believe let me believe then once I pour all of my epoxy in there and don't worry I had a lot left but I put it inside of a mold I'm going to use my little fire starter that we use for barbecues and just kind of pop any bubbles that are on the surface but just to make sure I'm not missing anything I spray with 99% alcohol and I let this frame sit overnight to get super duper hard and then when I came back I was ready to apply my decal. I knew that I wanted it to say Myra makes it because I worked really hard for my car. And, you know, I feel like it's like a proud moment to be able to put your name on something like, no, it's mine. Hee <laughs> hee. I, I, I'm the one driving this thing to go get nuggies every day. So, of course, I wanted to put Myra makes it on it. Also, maybe there could be like a little tumbler maker behind me at a gas station or at a stoplight and she could be my friend. So if you found my channel by following my car, hey, welcome. Or who knows, maybe Bad Bunny will see my license plate and be like, oh my God, there she is. I found her finally. Hee <laughs> hee. Okay. I don't like to measure or do any of that stuff. I just eyeball it. You know what I'm saying? Which obviously hasn't really worked for me because have you seen my eyebrows? But, you know, there's bigger things in life to worry about. You can use a ruler or measuring tape if you want to get it exact. So I take my sausage fingers and I push it down nice and good so that it's not going anywhere. Look at that beautiful shift. So pretty. And then to finish off, I went with another coat of epoxy, but a very thin one to seal that decal. I laid the thickest part of the epoxy over the decal. And then, of course, I popped my bubbles. I let it sit overnight. Look how beautiful it is. Now, I'm going to go ahead and use my tools to remove the old plate from my car. Haters would say these are my husband's hands, but I don't need no man. I'm a strong, independent woman. These are my hands. I just hadn't shaved. Hee hee. I hope you enjoyed my tutorial. Thank you for watching. Besitos.